so I really don't feel comfortable going over this until she arrives. Sorry I'm late. Things went a bit long at the doctor's office. Everything all right? Yeah, I just took Monique to get a final HPV shot. Her HPV shot? What's HPV? It's a sexually transmitted infection. Why are they giving Monique the HPV vaccine? Isn't she too young for that? Actually, she's the right age. The HPV vaccine is recommended for girls ages 9 to 11. My doctor says that HPV vaccine is best given to kids at a younger age, before they're sexually active. Oh, well, when you look at it that way, I guess that makes sense. Wait, what are we talking about? HPV? I still don't know what that is. Hold on. Okay, it says here genital human papillomavirus, or HPV, is the most common sexually transmitted virus in the United States. More than half of sexually active men and women are infected with HPV at some time in their lives. Half? Whoa. Well, what are the symptoms? Most HPV infections don't cause any symptoms and go away on their own, but HPV can cause cervical cancer in women. That's why I wanted to make sure Monique got the vaccine. I mean, if I can prevent her from getting cancer, why wouldn't I? Why didn't my daughter's pediatrician recommend that? Well, Erica's 14 now, I guess it's too late. No, it's not too late. The vaccine is also recommended for girls ages 13 to 26 who didn't get the vaccine when they were younger. But not older than 26. Too late for us older women. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, only up to age 26, it seems. Remember, it's supposed to be given before they become sexually active. Hey, how did Monique do with the shots? Did she have any reaction? Yeah, she went out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, her arm was a bit sore, but that's it. Her doctor said it was very safe and that a little pain was common. She also said look out for swelling in the area or fever or maybe a headache, but Monique didn't have any of that, fortunately. Well, I am glad I have two boys. This is one less thing for me to worry about. Oh no, boys can get the vaccine too. Why? Well, it says here that there are actually two HPV vaccines. Both prevent cervical cancer in women, and one prevents genital warts and other HPV diseases in both males and females. Sorry, one more thing to worry about. <laughs> or one less thing if you get your kids the vaccine. Okay, let me see that thing. HPV vaccines are a safe and effective way of preventing cervical cancer and other HPV diseases. Routine vaccination is recommended for girls ages 11 to 12, while catch-up vaccination is recommended for girls and young women ages 13 to 26 who have not been previously vaccinated. Males are also at risk for a number of HPV diseases, so boys and young men ages 9 to 26 can also be vaccinated against HPV. Females who receive an HPV vaccine still need to be checked for cervical cancer. Most experts recommend cervical cancer screening, such as pap tests, begin at age 21. Ask your healthcare provider what they recommend. If you have questions about HPV vaccines, visit www.ashastd.org to learn more.